Hey everybody, I'm Blitz. I've got an unboxing video for you today. So I've got the Toby iX. And what this thing is, is an eye tracking device that tracks your eye movement within games in different applications. Uh, it's a pretty cool piece of technology and uh, the developers of it saw me playing Elite Dangerous and they decided to send me one of these to test it out and play with it and see how I liked it within the game. It's it's really interesting. We'll get into that a little bit later. Um, so it is a sponsored video by Toby. I wanted to make sure you guys knew that, but I've been having a lot of fun with it. I thought it'd be something that you guys would at least find interesting. So let's open it up here and we're gonna just pop it out. It comes in a nice slide. The box slides open. It comes in another box. On the back of it actually has the, the system specs specifications. I'll show you another screenshot of that at the end of the video. And then we open it up. So I, I have I have played with it. I've opened it already. So it, it did come with a nice protective uh, plastic wrap on it. It's kind of dark on there, isn't it? Comes a nice little box that we can just pull it out. And it's about 16 inches long or so. And about a half an inch thick. On the back side here is the mounting bracket. You can see there's a the mounting slot right there and that just gets clipped in with uh, these things and this is a mounting bracket you can see there's a little plastic uh, plastic wipe on the back of this that we can peel off you can peel that off and that goes onto the bottom of your monitor like right in there so I, I've done that I've set it up already you take a, an alcohol wipe like what you get at like a barbecue rib place and, and then you, you put that right on there so that's how it sets up and it's a USB 3 interface that you can just plug right in. Let's go ahead and do that. I've already got it set up and it's gonna come up with like blue and red flashing lights, what you guys will see. So I only see red lights. There's no blue in there. I think that's the camera picking up on the infrared, uh, just flashing a little bit of blue in there. It's just solid, three solid red red lights on, on my end of it. But yeah, it sits right on there. These mounting brackets, man, they are like really, really stuck on there. And that magnet is pretty stuck too. So uh, it fits really nicely and really well on there. Kind of hides nicely too on a, a black monitor like what I've got. Uh, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna jump into the setup. I'm gonna take a cut and you guys will see the face cam going on uh, for the most of this video, showing you like how it interacts with my eyeballs. It's not too terribly exciting, but uh, the, the whole technology behind it and actually tracking the eyes is really cool. And then we're gonna jump into Elite Dangerous and we're gonna try some of the training missions out as how it, uh, I don't know, what's the word, uh, follows my eyeballs as I destroy some, some little ships. So guys, I hope you like this and uh, let's get into it. Okay guys, welcome to my desktop. So uh, down here in the right corner, we've got the iX and this is the software for it, uh, the, the interface with it. You can turn it on or off and you can, this is, it's, it's scrolling to where I'm looking. See the, the, the white going back and forth. I do have my glasses tilted at an angle so you guys can see my eyes, because if I do it down here, check this out. Uh huh, that's how I'd look. Uh, you're, you're supposed to see my eyes. So we'll put that back up. Uh, hopefully that'll work for this video. It has caused a little bit of interference for the iX itself. You can see it twitching out, the eyeball twitching out. We can go into the, let's see, let's set up a new profile. We'll delete that one. And we'll set up a brand new profile here. Create new profile. These are your eyes. Uh huh. There they are. Isn't that weird? Yeah, they're they're kind of they're kind of geeking out from my glasses. A little bit. It's a wrong angle. It's worked all the other times, but since I'm I'm trying to get you guys to see what my eyes are looking at, it's fine. But check this out. It's said to move around. Look how far back I can go. That's that's a whole arm length, at least away. Oh, there it kind of it kind of went. So about maybe two to three feet is how how far it, it can see. So that's really awesome. And if we could cover up an eye, so if I if I like wink on my right eye, so cool. You can see it. It it does actually track the eye, not just facial features, which is kind of what I was expecting uh, when I first got a hold of it. So we'll press the key. This should calibrate for the eyes, and this is going to come up with a dot. We just stare at the dot, and it pops. Comes up with three. I'm going to look to the bottom left. Bottom right, and the top. Isn't that cool? Just, just calibrates. Uh, the top left you can't see because my, my ugly mug's in front of that one. We'll close that one. Bottom, and top right. So this positions, it, it, it registers where your eyes are in location. They're just gonna go blitz to, that'll work. And we have glasses on, so we'll calibrate for those as well. 
Awesome. Back to the desktop. Looks like somebody has pinged me on Skype. Uh, let's do... Let's go into... Oh, let's do this one first. So this is the Infinite Screen extension. Uh, what this basically does is allows you to open up these apps. Uh, you can see there's the Armas, there's the DayZ. We have DCS World. I have no idea what that is. An Elite Dangerous Euro Truck Simulator, Flight Simulator, Stormavik, uh, Iron Front, and Take on Helicopters. So, Elite Dangerous is the only one that I play. But there are a few other things here like sensitivity, so you can change the speed up higher. So you look in the top corner, it goes faster. Or if your gradient goes way down, then it's gonna go really fast at the corners. I haven't messed with this too much. Um, I, I didn't really want to yet. And then there's dead zone. So if there's a dead zone at the corners, then you, you won't be able to, oh, I think that's maybe the middle. Yeah, a dead zone at the corners that you can't really look at. So if you wanted to position it so the cockpit would work fine, uh, that's what you would do, I would think. Uh, we're gonna leave that open and let's see, I, I queued it up, right? We did the setup. Oh, we're gonna do the intro. That's what we're gonna do next. So intro. Aha, your device is about to change forever. Anticipating your intentions. Redefining computing and gaming. Toby IX, enter the experience. Okay, so look around. Totally controlled by my eyeballs. Whoop. Exit. We don't want to exit yet. There's fun things to do here. It's like a playground for my eyes. Oh, hello there. Anything up top? Nope. Huh? Oh. Uh-oh. What? Now, now try looking around more. Oh, what's this? Natural targeting. I, I'm like, I'm surprised, but I know it's coming. Let's go to the top. Whoop! And back over. Ha ha! Meow, meow. That's so neat, isn't it? I'm just controlling. You can see my fingers here. I'm just controlling it with my my eyeballs. I'm not there. It's auto firing. Uh, Oh, a double kill. Okay, what else do we have in here? Oh, hello, big guy. Can I zap you? Ah, gotcha. Okay, what else? Exit. We'll go to the exit. And now we're going to queue up some Elite Dangerous. Okay, so I've queued up a training mission here. What training mission is, it's going to be a couple different waves of enemies that are coming at us. Uh, it will be in the cockpit, and I'll be able to fly around the cockpit so you guys can see, or I'll be able to look around the cockpit so you guys can see what's going to happen here. So we're going to resume, and there, I'm looking down at the menu. Oh, there's a guy right there. Hey, buddy. Gotcha. Now let's let him fly. <laughs> it's so foreign. It's so foreign to play like this. Because your your eyes are no longer following where the guy is. Well, your your eyes are following where the guy is, but your your ship isn't. It's so neat. Okay, there we go. We got him. Oh, checking his, his health out. Offline. Oh, this is one thing that I've had a problem with. So the game has... Um, what would be the word? Um, well, the the joystick system I'm using, I'm looking at my camera, and I should be looking at this. The joystick system I'm using has a key bind that counteracts with this thing, so it, it overwrites basically the mouse movement. I can move the mouse here, and it, it wiggles around, but uh, the game, or the, the IX, overwrites that. So I have to go down, uh, you can see the system energy and weapons down there, that is the controlling of the 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 power. So if I, if I turn my mouse off, online. I can finally adjust my power and my systems. So we'll do that and we'll turn the mouse back on. And now we gotta center it back. Cool. And let's go kill this guy now. He's directly behind me. This should work out okay. Hopefully he doesn't kill me too hard first. Let's look up. He's right behind me. Took all my juice out of my weapon or my engines too. Where are you at? There you are. We're coming after you, buddy. Gonna get you. How about we center it again? Look at this. Okay, he's up here. Gotcha. Target shields offline. Did I kill it? I killed it. Cool, we'll get another one here. Target I think destroyed. it'll. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's attacking me. What is this thing? Uh, it is a condor, huh? Where'd you go? There you are. 
you can kind of see where it hits that edge of the screen. It scrolls a lot faster. Pull back. Let's go up a little bit. There he is. Let the screen come back into play. Oh, that is so cool. We got a couple more guys here. Where are they coming in at? Uh, directly in front. Right there. I see you. Sidewinder. Oh, he just fired a missile at him. His shield wasn't down, so it didn't do anything. That one will. Kaboomski! Ah. What do we got next? Come fight me. Incoming hostiles detected. Multiple? Oh. Under attack. So I can lock Target the screen destroyed. too if I hold down the thumb or the, the pinky key on my, my joystick. So it'll it'll just naturally or it'll 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 be locked. And then we can look around how you, how it would feel natural to a gamer, and then if I let it go, it'll let, let me look up back at him. And then we'll get it centered back in the ship. Ooh, it was close. Under attack. Where'd you go? Come back here. Come back here. Ooh, you're a quick one. We'll hit you with another missile. How's that sound? Let me get you. Uh, we don't might not need one. We didn't need one. Perfect. Target destroyed. What's next? Be a couple more coming in. Uh, large hostiles incoming, or singularly, singularly large one. Shields almost down. Come on. Target shields offline. Keep it in there. Pull back. Let's go forward. Up. Follow him. Yeah. And we'll lock it in. There they go. Hmm. Missed. Well, it didn't miss, but it didn't kill either. This should kill. Perfect. Five, four, zero. And we'll do, let's do one more together. I think it's the Viper that comes up next. Target if not, destroyed. it's a, a big group. What do we got now? Incoming hostiles. Okay, let me at you. Let me at you. Got, ooh, an eagle. Where are you going? Down, huh? That is, it's so weird, isn't it? It's just following my, my eyesight. So I'm looking through the can. Oh, you're gonna hit me, huh? How'd that go for you? Look at this too, this is one of my favorite features. I'm looking at my hand and it's working how my hand is working. And so is the throttle. Isn't that cool? I don't think that, I don't think that, oh, that does work. Isn't that neat? And then the, the trigger? The trigger pulls the finger? How? Oh. oh, those work too. Oh, how, how about these? That one worked. Flight assist oh. off. Whoopsies, that is not what I want to do. Flight there. assist Let's put that back on so I can, I, I can fly right. Let's see. Let's go kill this guy now. If we can. I think we just got jolted. Okay. Hey, bud. I don't have any power in my engine either, so I'm kind of a sitting duck right now. There he is. Oops, wrong button. Come on. Target him. Come on, missiles. Target shields offline. Did I get him? I think I hit it. I did. Wow, that was good. Kaboom. Let's do one more because I like Target doing this. Destroyed. Okay, we got three now. What is this, the colonel? Target shields offline. I got him. Who's next? I guess you're next, because you're close. Target destroyed. First guy's gone, because I missiled his face in with a missile. But what are we going to do? Let's pull back. We'll, we'll go after... Under attack. I didn't even see you, little buddy. Vroom. Where'd you go? I don't see it. It does take quite a bit of Target time to get used destroyed. to. I played with this. How did he die? I played with this for maybe two to three hours to get uh, a little familiarity with it. Um, oh, there he is up here. And it's still totally foreign, the way that you'd normally think 
when you're playing a game. So guys, I think I'm going to leave you with this for... <laughs> I'm looking at the camera again. How about I move the camera Under over attack. here? It doesn't work because now the, the, the IX can't see me. Uh, anyway, I think that's going to do it for, for this. We'll just continue flying around and shooting things. Uh, I do have an affiliate code down below if you guys are interested in this. I, uh, it gives you Home the IX for... What is it? Shields offline. $95 instead of the damage. $140 that it typically would be. Um, and... You guys can check that out. There's a bunch of links and more information down below too in the video description if you are interested in looking into it. Anyway, I'm going to leave you with that. I'm going to leave you with this. I'm going to look over to the side and say goodbye and thank you for watching. Definitely check out down below in the video description. There's a whole bunch more information down there and the links that you can go to go to the different websites you'll need to be. And I'm all like looking around now. It's kind of weird. Anyway, thanks for watching and keep your stick on the ice. We'll catch you next time.